right. Jocelyn, I need your help today. What's today? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday? Uh. Sophia's trying to give away the answer. You can do it, Jocelyn. <laughs> <laughs> Jocelyn, is it Thursday? Mm -hmm. You're okay. smiling. Thursday. Yeah. Thursday. Stop. Awesome. Today is Thursday. Okay. What month is it? Is it January or February? Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, You're in the right place. Okay. January or February? February. Awesome. February. Good work. It's February, the heart month. All right. What's the date today? Mm. If yesterday was 17, today is the? February 18th. Yeah. 18th. February 18th. Awesome. Okay, I'm going to pause. All right, let's count to 18. I need some help. One. Two. <laughs> big money, big money. Three. What comes next? One, two, three. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Four. Five. Hey, wait. Use a five dollar bill instead. One, two. Three, four, five. Five of these ones is the same as a five dollar bill. Cool. Awesome. Five. Now, <clears throat> six. <clears throat> Stay on there. <clears throat> Seven. <clears throat> Guys, I swear. <clears throat> ah! Huh. That's what you get when the dog jumps on your board. Five, six, seven, eight. eight. Nice. Eight. Nine. And yeah, ten. Good job, mister. Hey, wait. I can use a ten dollar bill instead. Uh -huh. oh, all right. I'm going to take my five and five ones and turn it in for that $10 bill. Oh, 10 or not. Nope. Nope. Oh. And overboard. Hang on. Come on. Ten. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. I'm going to be here until eight o'clock tonight. So, um, fourteen. Hey, wait! I have one, two, three, four, five. What can I use instead? 
<laughs> what is that? Five dollar bill. Oh yeah, five dollar bill. I take my five ones. I make them into a five dollar bill. Now I've got my 15 as 10 plus five. 15, I need to get to 18. 15, 16, 17, 18. 18. Woohoo! $18. Boy, that sounds like a lot. A five, I know, right? And three ones. 18. Awesome work. I hope you set up $18. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Good work on the 18th of February. Awesome. Great work. Just counted to 18. It's kind of hard to believe. Do you think we're over halfway through the month? Ooh, wait, let's go back. February is a weird month, huh? How many days are in February? Hmm, let me check my handy dandy phone that gives me the calendar. There's 28 days in February. We've already had 18. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we have 10 more days of February. Which is bigger, 18 or 10? 18 or 10? 18. Yeah, 18 is bigger than 10. That means we're more through February. More Good February job. is gone than there is left. Good job. Oh. All right. Jocelyn, is it raining at your house too? <laughs> Did I hear cloudy? Hmm. It is. It is. Cloudy. All right. It's cloudy at her house. It can be cloudy at rainy at other people's houses. Just depends on where the clouds are. Is it cool or is it cold? Which one? Uh, Sophia, trying to give the answer away. Oh. It feels cold. Oh. Cold. Ooh. All right, Jocelyn. Ooh. What are you wearing today? Can you mm. go to your clothes mm. device? Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Ooh, pants like pants. these or sweatpants? Sweatpants. Pants. You said pants. Pants. Yeah, awesome. She's wearing pants. Tops. What are you wearing for your shirt? Do you have a t shirt under your sweatshirt? <laughs> yeah. Sweater. You are wearing a sweater. You're one wearing one with a hood too. We'll get to that one next. <laughs> All right. If you were to go outside, what zapatos would you wear? <laughs> Sandals. Oh, you and Haley. Sandals. What is with the sandal trend we've got going on in this class? That's so funny. You guys better wear some socks. It's cold outside. 
Yeah, I Looks like my cool. feet. <laughs> it is cold. <laughs> Keep those toesies warm. <laughs> they look like high school teenage girls. So huh? true. Very appropriate. So funny. All right. Do you want to wear a hat, Jocelyn, or just your hood? Hat. Which one? Hat. Do you like the winter, winter hat? Hat. Which one? Do you like that one? Yes. Yes, hat. Okay. Accessories. Do you want to wear anything else? Mm. Gloves. Mm. Gloves. She wants some gloves. She needs to stay warm with those sandals on. Good idea. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I know Travis is advising her. You're mm. wearing a... Eh? Sweatshirt with the hood, huh? Jacket or shirt? Sweatshirt. Jacket. You want to wear the jacket? jacket? You like the red one? Mm -hmm. I love it. Mm -hmm. There's Jocelyn, ready for the cloudy and cold weather. Awesome. On February 18th, 2021. Awesome, you guys. Nice job, Jocelyn. Awesome. And Rose. All right, we're playing bingo. Which one should we start with, Tulsi? Just a second. Walk. Walk. Does anyone have walk on their bingo card? Mm. Uh. Looks like this. Mm. Mm. Thank you. That's easier to read right there. Yeah. <laughs> no problem. Walk. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm. Walk. Mm. I'm going to go like this. Whoa. How do I do this upside down? Mm. Okay, I'm covering it. Walk has been done. Mm. All right. Mm. Another staff. Mm. Want to choose another symbol? You bet. I see an H. That I think that's hospital. Mm -hmm. Ooh, let me find it. Oh, here it is. Hospital? H for H. hospital. <laughs> H for hospital, you guys. That's right here. H for hospital. Okay, I'm gonna try another post-it. Do you guys can give me a sign number or a number between one and 40 because that also works as well. 20. All right, 20 is mm. no walking. Mm. We've done walking, but now no walking. Mm. Mm. No walking. I mean, you can't walk across the street right now. No <laughs> walking. Boy, that's what I've been doing in this ice. Oh boy, yeah. Not walking treacherous out there all right mr mike you want to give me a number or do you want to choose one <clears throat> number 26 okay 26 Ooh. Uh, uh, what's uh, this one railroad uh, crossing uh, yep railroad crossing <laughs> Two R's and a big X in the middle of a circle is a railroad crossing sign. <clears throat> Go work.
All right, Tulisi, give me a number. Yeah. Or anybody give me a number. Sure. Go for it. It's a stop sign. I want to see the number. Oh, 34. 34, yeah. All right. Yes, stop sign 34. Stop sign. I'm trying to make mm. it bigger. It's hard. Stop sign. Mm -hmm. Stop in your car, on your bike, when you're walking. Stop at the corner. Stop. Awesome. All right, Jill. All right. I already have one lined up. Ooh. Yeah, I yeah. spot I spotted one I like a lot. It's number 28. Ooh, I like that one too. <laughs> Which we were practicing it a little more these days. But yes. Guys, it's the school crossing sign. We don't have it. People crossing the street by a school. School crossing. That was a good one. Yeah. School crossing. Good job, mm -hmm. you guys. Anybody got a couple yet? I think there's nine spots on your board. Mm -hmm. I remember correctly. <sighs> Anybody got two yet? That'd be kind of a big deal. We've only done one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. All right. All right, Mr. Mike, do you want a number? Pick a sign. What do you want to do? Um, I want to see the sign. I want to go with number nine. Number nine. <clears throat> What's number nine? Fire station. A fire station. We have one right near Beaverton High School. Oh, yeah. And there's Great. a light right yes. there that tells you to stop when it turns on. <coughs> Fire station. Awesome. Did anybody have that one? We did. <laughs> Mr. Mike, did you used to work at a fire station? I did. Oh, that's oh. cool. Yeah. Little tidbit. Yeah, 14, you 14 years. Wow. A fireman or administration? Fireman. Well, very cool. Yeah. Wow. You guys, we learn something new every day. Yes. Love it. Sorry, I fished for that. I knew it. So. And, and in New York as well. Wow. Syracuse, yes. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> That's a big deal. Okay, does a student want to give me a number between 1 and 40? Okay. What do you think, Haley? Hold up a number. Hold up some fingers. Oh, yeah, good point. One through eight are up for grabs. Travis, was that a four? Four? Do you want to buckle up for safety? Ooh. Oh, I like that one. That is That's very important. Good one. Yeah. Travis, that was an important one for your wheelchair, too. Mm. Oh. On the bus when we go in the community or in your car. Buckle up for safety. Mm. Oh. Sophia's agreeing. Buckle up, guys. Buckle up. Did Haley put up a number yet? Uh, yeah. Okay. Buckle up. I think she's just pointing at someone she wants you to call. Oh. <laughs> Probably, I can't tell her right. She's like this one, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. 31. Uh, Did someone just say 31? Yeah, I heard that. Uh, 
that. It is signal ahead. Mm. Oh, mm. Said that. Well, yes. that Jocelyn. Yeah. Oh, like, signal mm. ahead. Traffic light ahead. Sorry, my light keeps flickering. Signal ahead. Mm -hmm. It's got your red for stop, yellow for slow down, and green for go. Oh. Signal ahead. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Oh. All right, Tulisi. Number 30, school. Oh, yeah. Limit. Speed yeah. limit. Yes. School speed limit. You better go slow yeah. when you go past yeah. the school. You'll get a ticket. I was going to say, <laughs> you could definitely get a ticket. Uh -oh. in school, mm -hmm. school speed limit? What? What's that number? 20. 20, guys. <laughs> Then why is it 30? Right. <laughs> now. 20. Yeah. Speed limit 20. Go slow. All right. Who's going next? Maybe Mika. Mika. Oh, yeah. Mika. Pick a number. Oh. Oh. I heard 12. <laughs> I heard 12, but 12's hospital. We already did it. Um, mm. um, uh, 15? What? 16? 16, 16 is... Both of those? No, you're good. 16 okay. is usually a summer activity. Oh. <clears throat> No diving. Hey, you have to be in a swimming pool to see that one. No diving, or maybe at the beach. Mm -hmm. Are you not to? 30. Like, Could be no diving because there's ice. <laughs> Bother. <laughs> that, that works right now. Yeah. Right? No diving in that snow. That's funny. Am I hearing Ryan in the background? Or dad? 30? I can't tell. Somewhere speaking in numbers. Did someone just say 30 or 31? Oh. Been both of those. <laughs> Anyone close to bingo? We're close. Ooh. And who said that? I, I that was Delilah with Mika. Delilah, yeah, okay, Mika. okay, awesome. All right. Anyone else want to give me a number or a sign they like? Oh yeah, I saw one. Um, what was it? Hang on. Nine, thirty-eight, thirty-seven. I think it was thirty-six. <laughs> oh yeah, Jill. Yeah, that's yeah. the one. Thirty-six. Yes. Wheelchair crossing. Bingo. <laughs> Woo -hoo, Mika. Yeah, Mika. 36. Wheelchair crossing. And that's bingo. You guys, we only had to go through it. Let's count how many <laughs> pink, pink stickies it took. Okay. Here we go. Let me post it up for you guys. You got you guys, I got a bingo on my own card. Look. Yes. Down the center. That's so funny. Yes. All right, how many pink cards do you see? I'm gonna hold it. You guys count. Wow. Why are you getting up now? I've got what? One, two, three, four, five in a row. Mm -hmm. I think so be here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I see 12. Yes. All right. That means we've got plenty more to start our next game. Whoa. Sorry. <laughs> I've got two phones in front of me and they both started ringing. I haven't figured out that like I'm connected to both now. Ah! 
Anyway, clearly what I need to do later after class. Uh, oh, so speaking of which, um, oops. Oops. Scientists made a discovery in the Southern Ocean on February 15th. The Southern Ocean surrounds Antarctica, the coldest continent on Earth. Most of the continent is covered with ice. The scientists drilled a hole into the ice covering the ocean. They put a camera into the hole and discovered ocean animals named sponges on a big rock under the ocean. The scientists were very surprised. The Southern Ocean is very dark and very cold. The scientists thought sponges could not live there. The scientists are very excited about the discovery. <laughs> they plan to study the sponges to learn more about them. Wow. Um, mm. So a discovery in the Southern Ocean Scientists made a discovery in the Southern Ocean. They made the discovery on February 15th. Ooh, I think that was Monday, right? It was. Yeah, on was President's Monday. Day. The scientists drilled a hole into the ice covering the ocean. They put a camera into the hole. They discovered sponges on a rock under the ice. Mm -hmm. I mean, life, you guys. Something's growing down there. Hmm. Sponges are ocean animals. The Southern Ocean is very dark and very cold. The scientists thought people or sponges could not live there. The scientists are excited about the discovery. They want to learn more about the sponges. I do too. That sounds cool. Oh. Okay, the first question, number one, what did scientists discover on a rock under the ice? Was it sponges, dogs, or birds? What would be under the water, you guys? Hmm. <laughs> sponges, dogs, or birds? Well, I don't think it was birds. Mm. Really? No birds under the water? I don't think they can breathe underwater. Birds. Okay. Thank you for your help, Jill. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, now we've narrowed it down. Are dogs where it's really cold under the water or sponges? Hmm. What do you think? Definitely not dogs. I was going to say, I don't think my dog dogs. would survive out there. No, no. But sponges are animals sponges. themselves. Mm -hmm. Why they gave all animal choices. Mm -hmm. All right, go for it. Number two, who drilled the hole into the ice? Was it postal workers, scientists, or astronauts? Well, hey, wait, where do postal workers work? Hmm. what this class is about right in our community they're around the world they hang out in communities and go pass out their mail are they gonna be in a very icy place the edge of the world i don't know postal workers no <laughs> what about astronauts way up in space or training on the ground. Are they the ones drilling a hole in the ice? Mm -hmm. Is that part of their job? No. Astronauts. But those scientists want to know more about those sponges. Scientists. Awesome. Okay, question number three. Where did scientists make the discovery? Was it in the Pacific Ocean, the Mediterranean Sea, or the Southern Ocean? Hmm. We live near the Pacific Ocean. Is the Pacific Ocean ice? Do we go to the ocean water and it's icy? 
No. Pacific Ocean. The hmm. Mediterranean Sea is kind of where it's warmer, right? Very warm. Yeah, yes. Very warm there, right? So that's too hot to be icy. Uh, I would you swim there. <laughs> you what? I would swim there. Oh, yeah. Sounds good to me. You still need a bodysuit probably in the Pacific Ocean, unless you're in like San Diego or Southern. But Mediterranean Sea. So where did it happen? In the Southern Ocean, where it's really cold. Southern Ocean. Awesome. Good work, you guys. All righty.